These are the two things I could make. A scraper. Well, I can make three things. A magnifier, a scraper, and a DNA analyzer. Uh, what is it, can I click on that? Okay, I think that's just a tool. E oh, I'm gonna click on well we'll see. Um bah, 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 bah. How's that getting energy? Oh yeah, a tesseract. Oh, where am I gonna put this? I don't feel like teleporting back and forth right now. Um, buckle, 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 buckle. Oh, we'll put it in our makeshift area here. DNA analyzer. Let's go scrape something. Ooh, I can make a microscope. I don't know what that does yet. Well, I, I know what a microscope does. I lost iron. All right, iron block. Get rid of all this microscope, uh, stone rod, glass. Okay. And doop, ba doop, ba doop, ba doop, ba doop. Make a microscope because it's fun. Rod. I think. All right, let's go put you down somewhere. I don't think that should that shouldn't take power. Should it take power? Might as well put it next to the analyzer. My infinite water source there. Let's put you there. Decoration, I guess. All right, back to scraping something. I need. These don't I? Is there a blank one of these? Uh, gene produ produced. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, okay, I'll figure all this stuff out. Syringe, syringe. What's a syringe? I need arrows. I need fletching. Okay. Now I need to take samples of my blood. Uh, basic DNA dictionary and cells. I don't know how to get a cell. Hmm. So I thought, okay, Scraper does a little bit of damage to mobs, just to tell you that right off. So it'll make them hostile when you scrape them. Um, and I thought I could find a squid really easy to scrape, but no. So we're going to go try Ooh, Spider Spawner. Huh? Um, ravine and see if we can find a bat, because the bat gives you flying. Alright, if I can find a bat anywhere, it'll be here. Let's see if I can get down and scrape that guy. Oh, we got water. That's a good place. Water. We'll jump in the water. Hmm, what? Jump. I will jump. Here we go. Ooh, spoosh. And lava. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Okay, here we go. Now, where's my little flaming guy? Get out of flame. And what is he? Ender zombie. Oh, did he just fall in the lava? Oh. Okay, what did I get from him? Nothing. Alright, let's go find us a bat. Nope, my bad. It's there on the ground. Let's scrape it and it drops. That's disgusting. Yeah, disgusting. Holy crap. Uh, skin scales. Skin scales of a fire zombie. Well, what? Let's see. Does this do anything? No. Did it go in there? Yeah. Alright. Boys, you scraped them all to hell. Oh. <coughs> hmm. All right, let's head back home and see what this does. You should just simply put it in a DNA analyzer. You have to do something to it. Well, we'll see. It went in. Oh, I'm probably still loading from teleporting here. Am I here now? Nope, don't read anything. Can I read this? Yeah. 
Yeah. There we go. And I got an organic drop. Uh, oh, and a cell. Aha. All right, we will scrape some stuff. Um, use organic drop. You can use it as a fuel. Oh. Which would be a bit of a waste. Um, no. Uh, fuel, that's it. Oh, what do you got here? Baked recipe? I don't... Okay, well, I'll we'll find out more. All right, and there's the cells. I needed cells to make better machines. So we're scraping stuff. They don't stack. You gotta be kidding me. All right, what is a... Oh. Cell of a fire zombie. Um. Well, it looks like I can make some better machines now. So I need a real setup. I'm probably going to have to set up the formal place at my other base. Oh, And then all my ME stuff will be here. Oh, fun, fun, fun. Alright, first of all, I need a bag of holding. Okay, I'm getting into advanced stuff. And I need this properly set up. So what I'm going to do is I need to move um, my Emmy stuff. And that's going to go in the square building at uh, um, the base. And then I can have my Emmy system there and my advanced genetics. Then if I need to do anything over here, it should work out. I think. I don't know. I just think I'm just talking to myself right now. I throw a fire charge in there. But now that I'm getting cells, cells, I can make uh, the um, other machines. Some of the other machines. Oh yeah. Yep, we definitely have to say goodbye to Ghetto Rinky Dink. All right, so we'll have a uh, assembly table floor in the base. We will have a advanced genetics floor. We will have hmm, processing floor doesn't belong in the tower, I don't think. Uh, well, maybe we'll have a uh, a thermal expansion floor and a BC or IC2 floor. Thom floor. Hmm. This tower is going to get taller than my windmill. Okay, I decided I'm not putting my Emmy stuff in the square building. I'm going to make it work on this floor. Somehow. And it should be enough because I'll have the uh, deep storage units top and bottom and have the item duct running through the middle. It'll block the windows, but eh, who cares? I got enough floors with windows. I'll make it work. Okay, I have spent a few days um, playing around. Died so many times trying to scrape uh, skin cells off of zombie pigmen because I want to be able to walk in lava thing. But I have gotten a uh, take no fall damage and I've gotten breathe underwater. Take no fall is from chickens and I got lucky. Um, no fall. Um, just the first chicken I got to, the scraper does minimal damage so you know you get about a uh, probably 2028 20, uh, skin cells to sample and same thing from the water breather the squids got um, got it on the first try what you do is you take those skin cells you put them in your analyzer let's get the organic drops out there that's a byproduct don't know what to do with those yet and the DNA, DNA analyzer uh, gives you a cell and then you put the cell in the DNA extractor. Um, I have also uh, made auto outputs and put overclockers on all these machines. Those are fun how those work and I'll show you on the other machines. And I finished making all my machines. These last two take the extra book. The uh, genetics... Ooh, what happened? Did I shut that off? There we go. The uh, You take a book, surround it with um, not insulated cell, just a regular cell on four corners 
and you get a basic DNA dictionary. You take your basic DNA dictionary and surround it on four sides with the cell and you get uh, the advanced, where is it? Advanced DNA dictionary. And you only need the advanced DNA dictionary for these last two machines and the basic DNA dictionary for all these other machines. So now I have it, the cells automatically go into the extractor and it turns it into a helix. Then the helix goes into the decryptor and it tells you what you get. Now you saw I already had no fall damage. Oh, this is a syringe of my own blood. Once you inject yourself with traits, you want to make a syringe of your own blood. <coughs> so if and when you die, you come back, uh, respawn, and inject yourself with the syringe and you have all the traits uh, left over again. I also have or all the traits back again. Now I also have an extra uh, no fall, a couple extra no falls, and an extra water breather. Uh, Ishtar is going to be coming in. My significant other mama baby beautiful wonderful marvelous magnificent Ishtar will be coming in the game and I'll get her some water breathing and some no fall and the no fall I have fallen from a hundred blocks so let's go up as high as I can here and oh can't jump over oh let's uh, go all the way up to my windmill here wonderful marvelous magnificent yes um, and normally you would die from a height like this and you fall and fall and fall and fall and fall and fall, and fall, and fall and boom not a single heart of damage now I have spent a lot of time finding the bats and the bat skin cells is what you need from flying and I had uh, about half of my golden bag I've lost two golden bags I've lost iron armor uh, spent some time in the promised land and remade a set of amethyst armor because that took a beating because these special mobs are brutal uh, getting back to the bat skin cells, I finally found bats. Uh, went spelunking for a while, made myself a good, good hammer, and used half of that in the promised land getting some amethyst. The other half trying to get down to a point where bats are. And you gotta love the, uh, the mini map up here, because it shows you where they are. So I finally got one, put in about 20 skin cells, and now it's time to see if I get a helix with flying basic chain fly look at that it the I guess these are all um, fly just need two that's fine by me so let's get a fly choose the gene well, let's do if you have something with two genes you get to choose which one you want to export this also has auto output auto output and now that gene went over here. That is a gene fly. Oh, it takes 28. What it does is it takes 28 um, helixes of basic genes, or those count towards one. This would count two, so it would take 14 fly um, genes or 28 basic genes. And you get basic genes after basic genes after basic genes. So let me get my second um, fly for a backup. And that's going to pop over here. Gene. Whoops. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Okay. Is there another fly gene in here? Basic, 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 basic fly. There we go. So the hardest part about getting the fly gene is finding the frappin' bats. So now I have a fly gene. And I'll finish that later, but right now I'm going to finish. There we go. Uh, this one. So let's find whatever these sort out. Uh, basic, 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 basic. Ooh. Fly. Uh, give me that. Really glitchy, the advanced genetics. Um, moving inventories. It's almost like a lag thing. Ooh, got a fly one there. Good. And a fly one there. What I'm going to do is speed this up. The overclockers really help. So we put a fly.
Okay. Oh, I got a baby Lola in my lap. Is she smiling? <coughs> yeah, baby. Uh, got my... Okay, got my... What is this? Fly. Chain fly breeding. Uh, that's not complete. Let's put this one in here for a backup. And go in here and get my complete one. And i show you the way to do this from scratch. I got an extra syringe over here. Yes. Okay, I got... Oh, crap. I got syringes of, of blood everywhere. Um, syringe is iron, 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 a bottle, and an arrow. Now you have the syringe in your hand. And you right-click it till it starts shaking. Let go. And poof, you got a vial of your blood. And this has no overclockers. I think this is pretty fast, so yeah, centrifuge is kind of fast. But let's make a couple overclockers, and you will not believe how insanely easy these are to make. Uh, you remember vanilla clocks? Four gold and a redstone. You got your clock. Zip that out. And I put your clock there. Show that by redstone, 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 and redstone. Four overclockers. Insanely easy. And centrifuge. Just right click on it. Put a couple on there. Overclocker two. And DNA combiner. We'll put a couple on you. Uh, let me eat a carrot. And get my blood. You have to syringe or uh, centrifuge it. Now you have my extracted blood and the gene. I want to combine it in the DNA combiner. You put your syringe blood here, the gene you want, and all that goes awesomely fast. Now you have the syringe filled with genes. You go back to the centrifuge, put that in there. Uh, even faster, so awesome. And now you have the syringe and you right click it, inject it, let go and you get a little bit of nausea and what I will do is go ahead and extract my blood again the centrifuge it again and now we can analyze it and you go over to your microscope which takes no power put it in there and it'll start analyzing it goes pretty slow one two three genes and we'll be back around 90 percent all right, I do not know how you can play Minecraft without flying, but that's part of the skill of playing vanilla, is you build these great immense structures and you fall and die. You do this and that. Fly! Water breather. No fall. And that's my blood, and I will store that off to the side. Um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and... I don't know what that is. Uh, can I... Oh, no, I don't want to take that. Let's just get rid of it. And this is my old ones. Now, I heard the flying is like um, creative flying. So it should just be a uh, double tap. And that's it. I'm flying. Oh, how I've missed ye. How I've missed ye flying. Now I get to see my place. I'm going to do a proper spawn tour again. Um, oh yeah, that is definitely not tall enough. That needs to get taller than the trees. Maybe I'll get it even as tall as the uh, my windmill up here. Um, so, I can fall. Take no damage. I can breathe underwater. I can fly. Um, I'm pretty set. The only last... The last thing I want to get is... Um, more hearts and bell has like 50 hit points 25 hearts and that is by taking some skin cells from an iron golem are those made out of iron i don't know but we'll find out and golem i don't think no um i have to um, find a village and protect them for a while get them to grow up to a population of I forget what it is but after they get to a certain population an iron golem spawns and then I'll take his skin cells and that'll piss him off but that'll get me more hearts so I'll be back with that one and then wrap up this episode I can fly it'll be so much easier to uh, 
to get around now. Now all I gotta do is find a village. And then get my golem on. So let's get my materials for the village, which is going to be uh, torches, fences, and a sword. Well, found me a little mountain village. <coughs> but I don't think they will uh, grow big enough to uh, support a golem. Looks like someone already found it. The doors are open. Anything in here? I'll take your books. I got no qualms about taking your books. Yeah. There we go. Give me that book. Yeah, I'll take them books. You're recording with your two month old infant in your lap. Yeah, on my chest. Ooh, there's a desert. Deserts is where I wanted to go to find a. Uh, um, oh, well, there's more down there. Yeah, that'll be a pain to protect, though. I want a desert village nice and flat, and I can fence it in and light it up. Um. Who is this? Oh, we're around, uh, okay, we're around 900's place. Yeah, um, that's probably why that village has been seen. Mm-hmm. So I need, I prefer to find a, uh, oh, what the hell, let's just look around this, uh, this village and see. If there is a golem that had spawned. It is amazing the, the terrain generation that happens with these new biomes. There isn't a single villager around. Probably because 900 is so close they just died off. Okay, when I find a desert, usually you get lucky and desert villages are huge. And that's what I need is the more villagers, the better. Um, I can look it up. It's a generic number. It's like 15, 10, 20 villagers, something like that. That um, Then they spawn an iron golem. Look, here's another village. With villagers. I think I can protect this one. Let's, uh, let's get busy protecting. First of all, what I'm going to do is set home village um it's almost night time so I don't want that I want some time to be able to set this up and I'm again once the only one on Okay, get my sleep on. Uh, and it's glitching out on me. Yes, it's nighttime. Sleep, please. <coughs> Thank you, daytime. I got ten minutes. And home village. Now, let's get your protection on. Shit, I should have brought the stacks. That's what I'm going to do. Um, stacks of dirt too uh, in case I need it so I need all my supplies Hey. Hey. Hey! What are you guys doing outside? Arg. Fine.
<laughs> I never heard that. One of the villagers. The, the uh, freaking. Oh, what the hell, though? Oh, what are they called from Star Wars? <laughs> Not Bantha's freaking. The traitor guys. Oh, well, I can't remember them, but that's the, the texture they have. I didn't know they made the sound too. That is too frappin' awesome. New pure DB. Thank you. BD craft. I finished lighting this place up. Made me a little door room. Uh, more villagers started spawning. I love a little baby villagers. And they're. The sound file is the same as the, um, oh, I should have gotten the name of those guys. I got tired of waiting for the Iron Golem to spawn, so Bell brought me one of the four blocks of iron and a pumpkin. I knew there was a recipe to make it, so it's just like the wither. It's, uh, do I have a block to demonstrate? Of course not. And the pumpkin in the center, and poof, iron golem. Took his skin cells, and now I have five extra hearts. And on my way back to my place, I found a witch, and now I throw potions. And it looks like it's just slowness, poison, and weakness. Yeah, which is good stuff. I got food on me, right? I don't. Oh, looks like I'm a picking some of these carrots right away. What happened to my carrots? Anywho, that's all, uh, that's all I'm doing uh, for the rest of this episode. So we done. So you all take care, and we'll see you next time. Peace out.